everyone, Kaylee here. Today we're doing curls on short hair and showing you guys how to get them without looking like Shirley Temple. A lot of my friends with short hair complain about that, so I wanted to help you guys out. First of all, you want to use the right tool. I recommend using a one and a quarter inch iron because a bigger iron gives a better curl. Once you have the right iron, you need the right method. So we're going to start out with that. First of all, you always want to use some heat protectant spray because it keeps your hair safe while you're heat styling it. And then you're going to section your hair. Now, because your hair is shorter, we're gonna start out with this bottom section, but it's not gonna be very, very curled. This is from your ear up, and basically all you really wanna do is get some bend to these layers. And the reason for that is that if they're straight and the rest of your hair is curled, it's gonna be awkward, but these layers are probably kind of short and hard to curl, so really all you need to do is just get a little bit of a bend to them, and that's really all that you're going for. So even if you can only just get them curled under, that's fine, you just don't want them to be straight. And if your hair has a natural wave to it, maybe you could just leave them natural. Then you're going to separate your hair from kind of the temples up. And this is where we're going to put the curls in the most because this is going to get you a little bit more volume without really enhancing the look of a Shirley Temple-esque curl. So basically what you're going to do is curl as close to the root as possible. I know in the back that's kind of hard, but especially around your face, make sure that you're getting really nice and close into that root. And what I'm doing in this situation is to curl all of the curls away from the face because I like how that looks. Although if you want a messier, more tousled look, you could curl them kind of alternating directions and that will give you a more tousled curl look if that's what you prefer. Additionally, if your hair is a little bit hard to curl, you can see that I occasionally hold the curl when it comes off the iron so it can cool a little bit curled. That would also help as well if your hair is a little bit on the hard to curl side. So now we're going to move on to the last section. So let the rest of your hair down and you'll see there's not a ton of hair left, but what we're going to do with this is just to curl it from kind of the midway through the hair to the ends. So you're basically just curling the ends of the hair. And what that does is it really enhances the great curled shape that you're getting from this hairstyle without making it look too tight and too placed. Although if you want to go up higher right around your face and curl a little bit higher, that's totally doable and I think it would be really pretty. Um, and it would completely complement this really softly curled look. So that's it for our very soft kind of romantic curls. And now we're gonna move on to what you can do if you want it to look a little bit more beachy and messy. I would take really small pieces from right around your part line and curl those next to the root. What that does is it creates little pieces of hair and kind of curls that just dance on top. They add volume and visual interest to the style and a little bit of messiness to the style without making it look like you've done tons and tons of little tiny curls right next to your root, if that makes any sense. So you just do a couple of those little curls just like that and then you're gonna run your hand through and just kind of mess them up just a little bit. Then I really recommend using a texturizing product like the Sexy Hair Spray Clay, which you guys know I love, or you could just use some hairspray while well, kind of like lifting the hair a little bit and you get that kind of messy look. So that's it for our messy curls. I hope you guys have enjoyed this first short hairstyle. Check back every Friday for more and make sure to check out yesterday's video. I'll see you again on Sunday. Mwah. Bye.